here at the Volo Museum, about an hour from Chicago, and it's amazing. Yeah, this is a family business. My uh, grandfather originally bought the property, and uh, I'm actually the third generation. But yeah, we're all completely family run, uh, 55 years in the making, since 1960 is when we first opened our doors. I'll show you something that my dad's been working on lately. You know, he's not too much into the uh, sales anymore, the business. He's, you know, doing what he enjoys, which is getting his hands dirty and playing with some of the displays around here. Yes, this is a caboose. We just picked this up yesterday. This is Ted. This is my father, Greg. Hi, Ted. Nice to meet you. We're just checking out the, uh, the caboose that we just got in. I wanted an 1895, and it's hard to find one that ain't all rotted out. I wanted one all wood. And the cabooses are all gone. It's an error gone by. You won't see a caboose anymore. Yeah, that's why I kind of wanted to get one of the first ones. And uh, this was the very first with the uh, cupola on top. What's that Eight called? Cu cupola. cupola. That's where they would sit up. They'd lived in here. This was their home. If you were a conductor, you'd be living in here. You watched the load. You watched the train. There's no problems. I mean, you got to remember, this was from 1895, so it goes way back. This came out of a building. It came out of a museum all indoors and they had to turn this whole thing around in the building lay tracks down it was quite a challenge we moved a lot of stuff here but this was a real challenge well there's the three of us over here my uh, two sons jay and brian and myself we uh all think the same we like the <laughs> weird stuff i mean we sell a lot of cars and we sell the cars all the profit goes right back into the business over here i turn into be such a big company and so much business, we have to do something. And people enjoy us bringing it here to the Midwest. Hello.